been approved? Well, I think that the approval of this convention by the General Assembly is a, a big step forward. Uh, so far, UNWTO, which is about global tourism, which is a very dynamic, vibrant global industry, had only a small regulatory instrument, which was a code of conduct, which was voluntary. Now, this time, we move from one stair, which is rather low in terms of capacity to regulate, to harness tourism as a global force, to a higher stage, which is a proper international treaty. And that's, I think, a big step forward for this organization, and it's a big step forward for those who believe that tourism, which may be nice for some, may be unnice for others. There are good sides on tourism, there are less good sides, and this convention about tourism ethics is precisely about addressing issues like sustainability, labor rights, behavior of tourists, which people sometimes are concerned about. So, a big step forward. Does this mean that this becomes binding to the members of UNWTO? Not yet. We still have, according to legal procedures, other steps. It has to be, it has been approved, it has to be adopted, and this is a question of official languages. Then it has to be signed by some who wish to take these commitments, which are legally stronger than the Code of Ethics, and then finally ratified. This probably will take a bit of time. Uh, the threshold for entry into force of this convention is 10 ratifications, which is a reasonably low number. So my guess is that by two or three years from now, this will come into force, and then we'll be looking for what next. Thank you very much.